Good morning, everyone. This is Coulterman Fox here, and I'm chaplain at Father Leo J. Austin Catholic Secondary School in Whitby. Do you feel sometimes that you're stressed or anxious? Sometimes I do, and particularly at these times. Are you unsure of yourself at times? Are you worried about the future? Are you wondering about God? Well, I have a gift for you, a legacy, in fact, to pass on to you. It's called Christian meditation. And it is simply prayer of the heart. It involves centering ourselves in silence and the silent repetition in our hearts of a single word or phrase, the mantra. Think of a word that expresses an eternal aspect of God, love, light, joy, peace. For a mantra, one commonly used in Christian meditation is ma ra na tha, which is the Aramaic language, the language that Jesus spoke. And it means, come Lord, the Lord comes. The continual gentle repetition of the word or mantra leads to an experience of silence and stillness. And just a brief word for you history buffs out there about the background, the history of Christian meditation. Meditation is a very ancient practice in several world religions. But Christian meditation, in particular, dates back to the Desert Fathers and Mothers, monks, priests, and nuns, in the third century in our Catholic history. It was practiced through the centuries and has come recently to us through Father John Main, a Catholic priest and Benedictine monk. In 1975, Father Main began Christian meditation groups in his monastery in London, England, and later in Montreal, Quebec. You might ask, so what are the benefits of Christian meditation? Well, here are some. Reducing stress, increased self-knowledge and acceptance, increased sense of well-being and harmony with others, increased desire to build community, calmness. Don't we all need calmness at times? Enhanced physical health, enhanced learning, enhanced hope. The benefit of it through, Christian, through a Christian lens is deeper communion with God and receiving the fruits of the Spirit, which St. Paul tells us in Galatians is love, joy, peace, patient endurance, goodness, faithfulness, and self-control. In short, Christian meditation is resting and dwelling in God's unconditional love for you and dissolving lingering doubts in a flame of devotion. So now let us prepare ourselves to do a meditation. Today we will only do a 10 minute meditation, but you're encouraged to increase the amount of time you meditate because as we know, the longer we meditate, the more benefits we will receive, the more graces we will receive from it. But let's be gentle with ourselves. We'll start slowly with a little bit today. Let's begin in prayer. And I will then lead you through the proper posture. I will then set the timer for 10 minutes and we'll end in prayer. So let us center ourselves in this moment. 
very much aware that the Spirit of God is within us, among us, and beyond us, calling us to do great things in humility for God. So we begin in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Loving Creator, you who birthed the stars in the skies and the dreams in our hearts, we praise you and thank you for simple daily blessings. At this moment in time, we ask you to send your spirit to open our hearts and minds so that we may experience more deeply your presence within us. And we make our prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. So now I invite you to sit still, quiet, and upright, sitting rather than lying down, because as we all know, if we lie down, we have, might have a tendency to fall asleep. Both feet flat on the floor, or if you happen to be sitting on the floor, if you feel more comfortable that way, then cross your legs. Place your hands on your lap, either downward or upward, whatever feels more comfortable for you. Gently close your eyes. Be aware of your normal breathing pattern for a minute. And just find your body relaxing. The more you breathe, the more you will relax. As you breathe in, Imagine you are breathing in goodness, which is Godness. And let go of tensions in your body. Just feel as though you're relaxing right deep into your chair or on the floor. And just breathe. In Hebrew scriptures, we learn the word ruah which means breath of God. God is the source of life. And breathing keeps us alive. God is as close as our breath. Now I invite you to think about a word that represents an eternal aspect of God for you, such as love, light, peace, or joy. Or think of a phrase or mantra, such as ma-ra-na-tha, which means, come Lord Jesus, or the Lord comes. Listen to the sound of your sacred word or mantra silently in your heart, as you say it slowly and continuously. If thoughts come or distractions, don't worry, just be gentle with yourself and come back to your sacred word or mantra. So I will set the timer now and we will meditate together for 10 minutes.
Please join me in a glory be. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. In the name of the Father and of the Son of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Make it a great day, everybody. I'm sending blessings to you and a spiritual hug.